blather 91 or blatherers now a blatherer is the one who's you know, basing their uh, their growth on blather because we're up to 90 and it's all follow the blather spirituality because it's a spirit of blather and uh, it's, it's theology and teaching and knowledge and ideas it's a way of life because it's it's a single spirit there's, there's aspects to the spirit but it's a single spirit of knowledge and data which flows on so there's um there's a lot you can get out of blather now a lot of data a lot of a lot of information a lot of spiritual progress and growth you can get out of blather it goes every which way but it develops you and it makes you think develops critical thinking and one of a, a blatherer you know blathers on about this and that in life as they go on searching probably for the keys of eternal life so they've got a lot of perspectives and they're able to comment on this and that because they have critical thinking because they've developed thinking from alternative points of view and uh, it's, it's a united sort of spirit but they, they have different perspectives and they're able to think you know you know uh, oh how is it laterally about the issues from different perspectives so you know a blatherer can think laterally and uh, get on with the job Now, a blatherer should probably focus on eternal life because blatherer's got up to 90, and this one's 91. So they, by now, you should be focused on eternity, on eternal life, you know, getting on with the job. So one of the things you've got to work out is what can kill you. So deadly spiders can kill you. They're things to avoid. And deadly snakes and poisonous animals, they can kill you. Lions can eat you. Tigers can eat you. You've got to be cautious about them. You, you, you fall off the edge of a cliff, you, you can die pretty quickly, so you better be careful and be careful about that. You're up on a skyscraper, you, you fall off, you're probably dead. <laughs> so eternal life on earth is keeping that stuff in mind. What can kill you? It's about what's good for you and about what can kill you. And when you learn to avoid what can kill you, and you start to put in, you know, principles of avoiding those problems, you know, things which can do you harm and do you in, and you start to build some uh, principles and paradigms of eternal life on earth in uh, in reality. Blather 91. 